so I'm trying to make um, videos of myself uh, talking about different things for a project that um, hopefully will start this autumn and um, it's really hard really hard because uh, I am so not used to being in front of a camera actually I've always hated being in front of a camera you know this stupid thing about how you don't think you should be because um, you're not uh, good enough you don't uh, look your best you don't have uh, the best clothes the best makeup the best hair maybe you need to lose some weight first or uh, uh, you know always some and there's always some reason and um, Actually, they're mainly just stupid if you think about it. Because if I have something to say, or if there's a story I would like to tell, then why shouldn't I tell it? Why, why hold back when uh, you actually feel like you wanted to share something, and when possibly the people you were going to share it with would have wanted to hear it or see it? So with that in mind... um. Last year I decided I was going to start making these uh, films that I am working on now and um, I had to overcome quite a lot of hurdles. Initially I thought to make a film I would have to get dressed and uh, put my best face on and um, try to think of having, you know, nice backdrops and look like I was actually trying but that's just not my reality. And um, it meant that I could only record myself like once every four to six, eight weeks maybe. Because actually that's about how often I manage to get up and uh, dress and out and all of those things. Most of the days, this is my reality where you see me right now, which is um, actually in uh, bed. Not even necessary. <laughs> not even properly dressed, but uh, most likely in my PJs. But I have decided that I'm going to have to just not worry too much about that either. I think uh, if I can um, survive showing myself uh, on camera for uh, whoever might want to watch in my PJs, you can probably survive watching me in my PJs. So here is what's going to happen. Uh, I am going to film myself pretty much every day, regardless of how I feel uh, or what I do, and uh, put it out here for um, for public scrutiny, maybe. Or, um, let's be honest, uh, probably it's going to be my kids, well, some of them, and maybe a few friends who will be watching this. And that is actually perfect because, uh, as I said before, the reason I wanted to make these films is because there is something I want to talk about that is very important to me. And uh, I have started uh, working on that, exactly what it is. Uh, I am not ready to tell you guys just yet, but uh, it is in motion and I am slowly inviting people to inviting um, family members to begin with and uh, some close friends and a few who have uh, particular knowledge of what it is I'm working on. Um, I'm also very, very happy because cause, uh, Emma, who is my uh, firstborn, wants to do this with me. And of course that is uh, such an amazing opportunity and feeling uh, for a mother that... Uh, well, for a mother, for me, it is fantastic for me that my oldest daughter wants to do this together with me because it is a, a subject that not only concerns me but also my children uh, and um, and it was for them that I wanted to do this in the first place because I wanted to leave a legacy behind of um, showing that no matter what there's always uh, something you can do. There's always uh, another adventure, another secret, maybe. Uh, always some more 
fun to be had and uh, you should just go out and explore it if you're and if you can't go out then um, there's still a lot of things you can do while at home uh, both in terms of planning the next time you go out and also writing about talking about doing something to to make tomorrow or next week or next month a better day or time than this one <laughs> there is a little one doing a time more fair next to me and wouldn't that be great if we could always off how'd you do it let me see a time off can i see it time off Oh, that's how you do it. You just hop. <laughs> so now you know. You just hop into something new and you have time morphed yourself into whatever it is you wanted to do. Um, on that note, I am going to time morph myself uh, into some clothes. And um, so I might uh, come back here later in a, a different time and maybe a different uh, form, shape, whatever. You never know how time morphs work. Uh, or uh, you'll see me another day. You never know. That's part of the mystery. But, but uh, yeah, I am totally embarrassed and whatever about this. But I'm doing it. I'm putting it up here. And uh, maybe come uh, September, October, there will be some proper stuff as well. You never know. But if you've listened through all of this, uh, thank you so much. Uh, it is uh, appreciated. And um, if you have any feedback to give me now or later, that will be most welcome as well.